video, we're going to understand the shortcut issue, learn where the settings are, and choose whether you want them on or not. Now, you may find that you use these shortcuts on your Mac all the time, in which case you'll probably want to keep them working on the Mac. Other times, you may even know, you know, not know they even existed in the first place, in which case you can safely turn them off, unless, of course, you're going to use them on the Mac. So, first of all, um, let's hop into Blender, as we're used to. And one of the things we're going to be learning more about in the next lecture is making this 3D view fill the entire screen which at the moment we can't do because if we use the shortcut keys which is control and up it launches mission control which doesn't help us with blender so what we'll need to do is make sure that mission control does not have ownership over control and up in order to do that well let's go out of mission control and we need to open up system preferences so i'm going to go there from spotlight and go system preferences um, under the keyboard options, now if you ever want to use the F keys as they are, um, they've got loads of other functions on a Mac, uh, you can tick that to use them as F1, F2, F3, etc. Um, now, when we're in here, what we need to do is change the shortcuts. Now what's in interrupting us with uh, Control and Up is Mission Control. And we can see there, Control and Up is, is taken by Mission Control, so we can just untick that. Now that's all we do when we go back to this window and go control up, we can there see it maximizes that particular window for us. Now as we start using other keys, you may wish to disable them if you're finding shortcut keys very useful. So you can go hop straight back to system preferences and I'm going to untick application windows and the left and right space because I know we're going to be using those in the next coming lectures. Okay, hope that's very helpful. It confused the hell out of me when I started using Blender on the Mac. I was like, well, where is this setting? I didn't even know it existed under this shortcuts area. Because for me, a shortcut is like doing control and up, for instance. I didn't realize that that's where you control the mission control area. But that's, that's hopefully going to help you out. And if you come across other shortcut keys which have a conflict, the reason why there's a conflict is because the Mac takes preference over any other programs that are running and this is operating system level. Anyway, enough of that, let's get back into Blender and stop fussing with the rest of the